Fort Dunn's Woods was the actual campus in 1885. This is the iconic representation of the Woodland Campus at Indiana University. The buildings were built at the edges of Dunn's Woods and they were going to be enclosing Dunn's Woods in a line of buildings, like a quadrangle of buildings with the woodland at the heart of the campus. It was an essential element in the identity of this university. I don't think there's very many universities, if any, that have a woodland at the center, at the heart of the campus. It's been about 125 years since this ground became the campus of Indiana University. And over that time, the attitudes towards Dunn's Woods have changed. 1885, it was just seen just a, as a piece of undeveloped land. And then by 1900 or so, the university started uh, consulting to talk about the future buildings and the grounds of, of the university. And that's when various landscape architects said that, that this is a characteristic feature that should be preserved and enhanced all over the campus, you know, even as the campus expanded. The idea was, let's not build within Dunn's Woods, let's build on the perimeter and also buy new land to build new buildings. But the idea that the, the woods and these wonderful patriarchs of the forest, that was one of the terms they used, uh, was a essential element. Dunn's Woods became this wonderful uh, resource to think about the woodland character of this campus and by extension the woodland character of southern Indiana. <laughs>